Hi, welcome back to another quick guide. Today I'll teach you how to make live split auto split. And it's literally an easy process, so make sure to watch until the end of the video to know how it's done. To set up live split for auto splitting and speed running, you need to configure it, recognize certain events or conditions that trigger automatic splits. And here are the steps to do this. So the first thing we need to do is visit the LiveSplit website and download the latest version of LiveSplit and install it into your PC. And now let's start the official steps. So the first thing we need to do is launch LiveSplit on your computer. Right click on this block timer. Go for from game list and pick your game. And since I'm unsure, I'll go with Portal 2 due to its access to auto split features. And take note that only specific games have access to auto split. Now specify the splits you wish to focus on for your run. For example, I might choose to undertake the single player mode. On attempts, I confidently choose one. And this section, you can't include the names of the goals you aim to achieve. To do this, click on the empty space next to segment name. For instance, or for example, in this game, I recognize the goals on name. One scape chops 12. To add more, click insert below and name the next one Puzzle Acquire 5. You can also customize split time, segment time, and best segments. Additionally, you have the flexibility to insert icons, download the image through a browser source. Click on the designated area, locate the file, and open it to add an icon. You can repeat the steps for each one. Once you've configured everything, click OK to confirm and finalize your settings. Now to make this column do, go ahead and right click on it. Then hit the layout settings. Then go to split. Then on a total split, make sure it's two. Now let's configure auto splitting. The first thing we need to do is go to the live split website and find the auto split component for your game. Download the auto split component for your specific game. Step two. Extract the downloaded auto split component. Step 3 and live split. Right click on your split. Choose activate auto splitter if available. If an auto splitter is available for your game, configure its settings. Check the game's community for the auto splitter's documentation for a specific instructions. Step 4. Start a run with a live split and test if the auto splitter works as expected. The auto splitter will automatically trigger splits based on predefined conditions such as reaching specific endgame events or achieving certain criteria. By following these steps, and configuring the auto splitter for your specific game, you should be able to set up live split for auto splitting during your speed run. And please be aware, as previously noted or mentioned, that only certain games are granted access to auto split functionality within this code. And that's all for now, folks. Hope you like and subscribe. Thank you.